so excited to announce a brand new tool that we have built not only for our students but for the entire Miami Valley region. What is so exciting about this tool is that it provides tons of information about jobs, what jobs are available in the community, what kind of education you might need in order to get that job, how much it pays, information that you will want in order to make decisions about your educational pathway and your college. Just this weekend, I was um, hosting a birthday party for my daughter and um, the family was talking about my 17-year-old uh, cousin who is contemplating what he's going to do, where he's going to go to college, what he's going to do with the rest of his life. And uh, there was discussion about different career fields and there were discussion about him becoming a pharmacist or a farm tech or a, uh, a farm tech assistant and these various career kind of areas. And I mentioned the career tool. And so we sat there at the party, pulled it up on a computer, and he got a chance and the family got a chance to take a look at some of these different occupations, get a sense of, okay, what's the educational requirements? What's the pathway to get there? What can you expect to earn? It's not always a, um, an easy decision to make and having a tool that helps you look into what your future could potentially look like and all the possibilities with just one degree is um, very, very helpful. All those things are relevant things that were on, on the mind of not only this young person who's trying to figure all this out, but also his parents as well, which is also a source of great anxiety. So the tool is just such great uh, value because it's right there at your fingertips. All you got to do is pull up the website, take a look at it, and you immediately get a sense of what's happening out there in the world with, with these jobs. And uh, you get a sense of, of where the opportunity is and isn't where the jobs are, and it takes a lot of the mystery out of it, which I think is probably the source of most anxiety for young people and their parents is the anxiety of, what do I love to do? What do I want to do? How do I get the education I need? How do I get the jobs I need? I wish I had a tool like that because when I started college, um, it, was, it was very overwhelming trying to think of all the different things that I could uh, the different degrees I could pursue and then when I tried to Google you know the income and the job possibilities there were so many different um, so many dif different websites and you don't know what's reliable and what's not and having a tool on the Sinclair website because 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 of the reputation that Sinclair has you know that it's reliable information that they did a lot of research before putting it out there to students and it doesn't have to be a complex puzzle. The, the self-exploration part is hard enough as it is for a young person. We don't need to add any more anxiety or any more uncertainty to, to the equation. What we're trying to do at Sinclair is try and alleviate some of that anxiety or alleviate some of the uncertainty that's out there. Uh, and this tool is the perfect way to do that. So I used the tool that's on Sinclair's website and I really liked how it showed me jobs around Dayton and the surrounding area. We're able to see whether a job is in right now or whether it's fading, there's a little chart that shows you if it's in demand. Um, it also shows you the estimate of the annual salary. That way you know if it's something that could fit your lifestyle. Um, there's a lot that it helped with. The tool provides all kinds of great information based on career fields, based on these pathways, uh, readily available for free to anyone who wants it. No expectation, no obligation. If you go to Sinclair, we're thrilled. We have a lot of options for you. But if you go somewhere else, that's okay too, because we know eventually you're gonna be able to come back to Sinclair to get an additional credential, a certificate or something. Even if you go off and earn a degree somewhere else, we're seeing increased numbers of people coming back to us with bachelor's degrees, sometimes master's degrees, who are looking to pick up a specific certificate to improve their quality. So we're a part of this greater ecosystem. We know that we can provide a lot of value for the families in this community, and we don't really need to ask anything direct in return. We provide it because that's who we are and that's what we do. We provide service for this region. We provide service for the community. We provide outstanding value, and, and we're just glad that people are using it. I think that the part of the tool that I liked the most was um, the, the portion where it allows the students to look and see what skills, um, what abilities and what knowledge they would need for each uh, career. I think my favorite thing was that it allows the student to find what we like to call as the sweet spot. 
Um, so looking at things that they're good at, but also what they are really passionate about and what they have the skills to do and what they like to do, putting that together. So um, I think that when you put that together and it allows the students to see exactly what they need for each career um, and an occupation, um, I, I just think that's a really valuable tool for our students to, to get to see, is this a good fit for me or not? What's also really exciting about this tool is it's not only for Sinclair students, it's for the entire Miami Valley region. And we're not asking for any information. You don't have to give us your phone number. You don't have to give us your email address. We just want to provide the information that you need in order to make a smart decision about your educational pathway and your career goals. Career exploration tool really speaks from our mission. So we believe in an empathy model. We believe in a model of demonstrating value to the community because that's who we are. As a community college, our number one priority is to serve the community. And so we recognize from talking to parents and students and employers, that there was a disconnect between what our students were choosing and thinking about and understanding in terms of the world of work. And there was a, a need for more uh, talent in the work in the workforce from our employers and we thought how can we bring to bear a tool that brings all this together. I love that they also included what they call like the bright outlook. So being able to see that ray of sunshine next to the careers that had a great uh, future broadcast in um, the opportunities that will be available was really awesome. So I love that that aspect of it and I love being able to just click on the career and dig down and get all of that information. So it's really helpful. So with this tool, we're gonna to provide you information such as, is this job available in the community? How much will I make? What kind of education do I need? You're gonna have all the information to figure out if this is a smart choice for you. And the great thing is, with this tool, you can search hundreds of jobs and get a sense of what might be the right fit for you. Let's take a look at how it works. So this tool is so easy to use. All you have to do is go to www.sinclair.edu, scroll down, and find the section that says, Make Your Dream Career a Reality. And there will be four boxes that you can click on. Career Options, Program Pathways, Prior Learning, and Job Listings. Let's take a look at Career Options. So let's say my daughter is interested in math. and She's talked about wanting to develop software because she's very into, very much into video games like Minecraft. So let's look at software development. If you want to narrow the search, you can say, okay, I want to look at a software development program where the minimum requirement is an associate's degree. And you'll want to figure out what jobs are available in your region. So we're going to keep it at Southwest Ohio but there are lots of different options you can select to really customize your search for exactly what you're looking for. So we click the search button and all these wonderful careers come up that are available in the Miami Valley. So let's take a look at this first one. Computer Systems Engineer Architect. Okay, that might be a possibility. You click on the plus button and all this information is right here available for you to explore. That's helpful information to know. How many jobs are available? It also talks about how much you're going to make and it gives you a range so that you know when you start out, you may, you may be making in the 30s and at the end of your career, you can expect to make six figures. If you hit the select button, look how exciting this is. It shows you salary by experience, it shows you employment projection, and it shows, this is really important, it shows that this career has, have, has had a 7.91% 10-year job growth. So when you're looking at careers, you might want to think about what careers are growing in the region. So actually, funny enough, um, back in the day, um, I was thinking about becoming an actuary scientist, and so they deal with like insurance and whatnot. And the the pay for them is about a hundred grand, but the job growth was like a hundred percent or a hundred and fifty percent. And it did make me switch over, but it made me it made me think twice on like maybe I should like look further into like different careers and different like 
um, different jobs I could possibly do, or it made me think it, or it kind of made me think like, what's another um, degree I could get that could be more um, versatile in what I could choose to do in the future. In addition, this is also so exciting. It talks about core tasks, what you will need to do to be good at this field. So if I was sitting down with my daughter and we were looking at this career, I would talk to her about collaborating with engineers and software developers. Um, you're going to select appropriate design solutions, that you're going to be dealing with systems and engineers and compatibility. I'm also going to go through the skills that she will need to be good at. So for example, what skills are helpful when you're looking at this job? Well, reading comprehension, critical thinking, systems evaluation, active listening, writing, and so forth. Now, as a parent, I'd like to think that my daughter is good at all these, but we know that she has certain skills that are better than others. What I think is so incredible about this tool is not just that we're helping students find jobs. Obviously, that's an important part of this. But what we're really most importantly doing is helping people find their passion, find their career. And a career isn't just about one job. A career is about what you do to grow and better yourself. Yes, maybe earn more or get more prestige as a position as you kind of move up. But it's really more about fulfillment. At the end of the day, that's what work life or vocation, the calling we have to work is all about, is the fulfillment of a passion that you have or an interest that you have. And at age 17 or 18, you may not know much about that passion. It may just be, you know, a fleeting interest or something that you're learning about. But over time, that passion begins to emerge. And as individuals build skill and they get a little bit of experience, they begin to grow and grow and grow. That's why we're building this, this tool. So I can help her find a job with the skills that really fits who she is. Because if you find a job with skills that fit who you are and what you're good at, you're more likely to be successful in that job. Also on this page is it helps you look at what type of education people in this field hold. So if you look at this field, about 10% hold a certificate, and that's probably going to be most of your entry level folks. About five to 10% have an associate's degree that takes them up to the next level in this career field. The majority hold a bachelor's degree. That's gonna help you get to that mid-level salary range. And then, depending on if it's a master's or professional degree or a doctoral degree, about five to 20%. And those folks are gonna be the senior management within that career field. So it gives you a really good sense of how many people in the field hold what degree. So when you're designing your pathway, you can really make sure that you're designing it correctly for the job you want. What's also fantastic is there's a section called Related Sinclair Programs. So let's say I'm sitting down with my daughter and she takes a look at this and says, that sounds kind of right, but I'm not really sure if that's the right job for me. We can then go explore all these jobs that the tool has suggested might be a good fit if you're interested in the software development. All this information is available, two or three clicks, free to the public, free for anyone to use. I love that Sinclair has this as a resource to the community and not just for Sinclair students. Um, our students typically join um, as Sinclair students at the end of their first year of high school or second year. And so the ability of our students to get in there and members of the community to get in there and, and start playing around and figuring out what is a good fit for them and what they wanna do before they start classes, um, it's just invaluable. You can tell your friends to use this. If you're an adult learner that's looking to maybe change jobs or enter a new career, you're going to want to make sure that you select a job that fits your skill set but also has growth, has good wage potential, and is available in the Miami Valley. Many of our students may not have the social capital to know that these careers exist and so seeing this very, very deluxe list um, or expansive list of um, careers available was really great. And that's the thing with all the jobs now. There are so many different variations of different jobs. It can be very confusing. You might, you might think it's one specific keyword, but in reality, it's, you know, variations of that. 
And what's exciting for a student then is you can see some of the other options you have. You may you know, love to work with interacting with people in a healthcare setting and you may think that this is the only pathway to go but discover that there's actually three or four maybe other pathways that maybe have more jobs in our area or maybe pay better or maybe give you more satisfaction because of the type of job that it is. And the tool gives you all of that right at your, right at your fingertips. So let's say my daughter is really interested in this career field that we have been exploring. We know how much money she could make. We know how many jobs are in the area. We have a lot of information about this job. But now the question becomes, how do we get there? So all you have to do is go into Related Sinclair Programs and click on the program that you're interested in. And it comes right up. Um, Computer Information Systems, Network Engineering. And look how great this is. It tells you everything you need to know about the program and really breaks it down into language that my daughter can understand. So for example, it talks about different certificates that are embedded within this degree. It talks about what you might be doing. So for example, you're going to be routing protocols, troubleshooting routing and components. Um, you're looking at technologies required for network and internet communications. Um, it's gonna tell you all about this program. And then if you scroll down a little bit, it will tell you the specific program outcomes that Sinclair will make sure that you receive in this program or any other college you select. I looked up my, um, the different jobs that are underlined within my career, what I could do, so like data manager, um, a database manager, things like that, and see what, and I saw what money they could make because obviously I, I want to know like the job outlook for my career because if if I don't know the outlook then like what am I getting myself into so like I really like had to look at the different careers I could choose from my um, from my degree so I could then like plan for what I want to achieve in the in the future and here's what's really important it talks about transferability because at Sinclair you can get an associate's degree and then transfer to one of our amazing university partners. So let's say that my daughter or my friend or I have decided on this program. We know all about this program, but we'd still like to talk to someone who is an expert in this program. Contact information is right here for you. So for this specific program, Professor Eric Renniger, who is an absolutely phenomenal professor, <laughs> here's his phone number and his email address. So you can contact him with any additional questions that this did not answer for you. So we are giving you direct contact to our faculty and chairs so that they can answer any program specific questions for you. So I loved that and I also loved how they showed the videos where they could see a person doing that job on a daily basis. I think that um, for our students they may not have the social capital to see people in their world who have done this job and they can ask questions about their career. So being able to see it in action I think is really valuable. Let's say you're looking at a lot of different programs and you're, you're not 100% sure what you want to do. You can click on this academic advising button and it'll take you to information about our advising center. That's an additional service that we offer for you. If you want to know how to enroll, there's a button for that. And if you want to look at financial aid, there's also a button you can click on for that. So after looking at this program, let's say my daughter is really excited about this program and this is what she wants to do at Sinclair. As a mom, I want to know how much it's going to cost. This tool will tell you exact numbers. All you have to do is go to the tab at the top that says Explore Programs. Okay. You click on this plus sign and right here is the estimated annual cost. How much it'll cost if you're a Montgomery County resident, if you're a resident in a different county but still in Ohio, or if you happen to be an out-of-state student. But what's really exciting about this is this is the estimated annual cost. So that's for an entire year of education. But what's not factored into this is all the additional credit that your child can receive in high school. So if your child goes to a high school that offers college credit plus, 
your child can get those classes, they'll transfer into this program, and this cost will even be reduced further. We also offer at Sinclair a plethora of different scholarships, including College Credit Plus scholarships and Tech Prep scholarships, which will decrease this even further. What this means is your child could get an associate's degree for literally just thousands of dollars instead of $100,000 or what other private institutions might cost. So as a mom of three children here in the Miami Valley region, I know how important it is to find the right college and the right career for your child. You want to be talking to your children about this now. What are they interested in? What do they hope to achieve? What subjects interest them? What kind of careers interest them? And they can use this tool to explore this all throughout high school. Oh, this would have been really beneficial in high school because like in high school, like you're not really told much. You're just told yeah. like, hey, like, go to college, like get like a part-time job and try to pay your way through. If you get student debt, you get student debt, whatnot. And, but they don't really tell you like, hey, like these careers like are like, kind of like the determining factor of your life. So if you get a career that's good, you get one that's good. If you get one that's bad, then you get one that's bad. But like, they don't really tell you how to like find these careers. So like this tool would have been really helpful in high school. So you could have seen, so I could have seen like, hey, like this is possibly something I could go into, or this is something I don't want to go into, and it could have been helpful to like different students within my student body. I would have loved to have this tool before I came. Um, if I would have known it, it would have helped a lot with finding jobs and, and knowing exactly what my education level can get me. Because um, some people will be surprised how, how high paying, you, how high paying of a job you can get with just the education that you have right now. A student may come to us with uh, uncertainty about either their career or their vocation or just even about themselves. And so part of this process is helping the individual gain that skill and, and, and self-confidence to really to do well because we know as you go through your life, you're going you're gonna to take lots of different kinds of jobs. You're going to pursue maybe one career, but you may adjust. And it's not a perfect linear kind of thing. It gets talked about as if you're going to have this clear vision pathway from start to finish. And that's just not the way life happens for most people. For most people, it's that the future reveals itself in small but profound ways along the way. And that's the point, is, is what you're doing along the way. And so a tool like this gives students the sense that you can do this. You can get an internship or you can get an apprenticeship and begin working immediately to help pay the bills and get going. But what really happens is you begin to discover yourself. You begin to understand what you love and what you don't love. You begin to get a sense of what work life is really all about. That's when you begin to get a sense of career direction. It doesn't happen magically. It doesn't happen through um, somebody necessarily just telling you something, even though your parents do give you a lot of advice, uh, it comes through self-exploration and self-growth. And uh, again, the tool is really designed just to equip young people and their parents and adults as well with information to be able to better make some of these choices along the way. One thing that's really important to remember is Sinclair offers a lot of different options in terms of certificates and associates and career paths. But we also offer a lot of transfer programs. I especially like the fact that there are um, transfer lists and guides that are uh, connected in through the tool. So for many of our students, um, they may uh, take classes at Sinclair while they are a high school student through College Credit Plus, and this tool is certainly useful in them starting those classes to ensure that they will transfer and go towards their major that they want to use at um, in college. So I love the fact that those transfer guides are there um, and they're just so useful for our students. Sinclair exists within a collection of very strong higher education institutions within Southwest Ohio. We are in probably one of the most fertile areas in the country in terms of quality higher education programs. What makes us distinct is our work towards and ends is in direct alignment with the community. The one thing that I also uh, really enjoyed about this tool is the way it can help families make informed decisions about their future pathways and decisions for college. You can work with your child and go through different careers and you can look at, hey, do I need a certificate or an associate's? Do I need a bachelor's or a master's? 
And then you can map out a pathway to turning your child's dream into reality. That really helps signal the world of work and the quickly and rapidly evolving world of work. And how do we connect our students, their interests with these various pathways and to do so in a way that's easy and convenient and free. Um, a tool that doesn't ask anything of anyone other than just to use the tool and tell us how it can be better. It provides a community also the ability to really make informed decisions about their future and future careers, which makes our city and surrounding area better as a whole. Our mission is about alignment with the needs of our community and then working hard every day to fulfill that alignment. Why this is so Im important is not just helping individuals find jobs, but the act of a college being of service to a community. Not just a college asking students to come to the college or come to the university. It's an act of, here, let us give you something. Let us um, show you value and show you um, the kind of things that we're, that we're capable of and what we do. And then if we can be of help beyond that, great. We've got lots of programs, certificates, degrees, transfer kinds of things, all different types of things that are gonna help individuals with their goals, regardless of where they are going. But we're doing that demonstration of value first. We're putting that in the hands of the community first, before we ask anything. And that's really what makes a community college unique, and that's what makes Sinclair really unique among uh, colleges and universities, and in particular, community colleges.